Alrighty then, here we are for episode 2 of the Dungeon of Nahul Book. Back, whatever. We're going to use part controller and part mouse because that seems to work the best. The controller obviously is to move us around. And the mouse does everything else. I think I'm hearing some vague chanting in the distance. Yeah, I think it's too quiet. This room might be trapped. Beware. We should find some other way. I don't listen to you anymore. You're a downer and you bum me out. I just have a survival instinct. Coward! Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's with all the shit talking? Put on them kissy buddies. Wait, where's he going? He just... <laughs> oh, dang it. A trap! I told you so. You should have detected this trap. No one asked me to. What? You... Well, it's official. I'm going to ignore the thief now. Anyway, now we're asking you. Would you mind looking out for traps, please? Well, I'll see what I can do. I don't get why we're wasting our time with this guy. Neutralizing a trap is a risky endeavor which could bring one to a gruesome end. I've got a bad feeling about this. A trap. It's a staple of dungeoning and can be very dangerous for your team. Thankfully, the thief can detect them. To activate trap detection mode, choose the thief as your leader. Detecting a trap is good, but disarming it, it is even better. Once he has spotted a trap, the thief can try to disarm it, get closer to the statue, and interact it with attempt to disarm it. And what statue are they talking about? This one? Or, oh, maybe this one? Nope. <laughs> this one. All right. So he's got a 100% chance of disarming this thing. Slowly pull on the latch. Nice. Well done. That's one less trap to worry about. After successfully disarming a trap, the thief can add a bomb to the inventory. You can equip it on his belt to grant him more tactical possibilities. All right. So let me see if I can remember how Oh, what a pretty drawing. What is let's it? Let's go to inventory. Let's go to the thief. The poor get poorer. Let's see if we can find that bomb. There it is. We're going to equip that bomb for him. There we go. Good deal. Anything else? Uh, nothing that I can see. So we'll back out of there. Also, we, we do want to see the map, though, because we're kind of wandering off. Where was the map? Grom doesn't need a map. Here it is. These are all areas that we have checked. Have we been through all of these? Yes, because that was where the chest was. All right, there's something over here. Let's go see what it is. going good evening ladies and gentlemen whoa what the f is going on now welcome to the fabulous contestants of our show the wheel of misfortune oh, great. hosted by our sponsor durandil swords with durandil swords friend of all warlords talking goblin impossible huh. he must be half goblin yeah but what species could look at a goblin and want to have its babies mix violence and alcohol and bam Anything can happen. Here we have our squinty-eyed ranger, our headstrong barbarian, voracious ogre, an almost but not quite wizard, a gawky elf, a chicken shit thief, and a dwarf. You know, just a dwarf. Welcome, dear contestants. Have a go at our wheel and discover your destiny with our sponsor, Gut Helm Helmets. With a Gut Helm Helmet, you can ransack an entire kingdom. If there's loot to be made, we should trade. We'll kill him after. Come on. Wait, wait, wait. Be careful, this game could be cursed in some way. Oh, you know him. He's just kind of headstrong. Great. 
debate, our friendly contestants just won 5,000 gold coins, courtesy of our sponsor, Gorzine Detergent. I'll Gorzine take it. to scrub Gorin beans. Epic. Yeah! And since we're not stingy, we'll throw in some healing for the entire party. Awesome. Look at that. But I do have some split ends. Hmm. It sounds too good to be true. This won't end well. I'm sure of it. We'll take another spin. More. More gold. Oh, Again. No. More. Don't be afraid. Have a good, strong spin. You can never lose. That is a good shampoo. Yeah, but I'm not sure it can help us untangle this mess. All right, 5,000 gold coins. What do you think? Spin the wheel? Don't spin the wheel. Spin the wheel? Oh, it's going to be ugly. I know it. I just got a feeling. Get that face of death. We're in trouble. Oh. Well, that might not be good either. Oh, no. What a stroke of bad luck. You just lost all your previous winnings. What? Did no. we lose everything? Little rapscallion. The skin you and I give our money back! Come on, don't fret. You can decide to stop playing now or go for one last spin. But I must warn you, the consequences could be dire. It's not such a good idea to keep going. This seems to be rigged. No, just one more. I'm gonna win it. I can feel it. Good coins. <laughs> totally lost it. Come on. <laughs> Alright, man, what do you guys think? No, oh, I can't I believe we gold. lost. I can do it. I think we... Oh, God. Here comes the death... The death head, I'm sure. I wonder if they would have let us... See, I knew it. I was wondering if they were going to let us walk out with the 5,000 bucks. Great! Our brilliant contestants win the highest prize on the Wheel of Mid... Yippee! A magic item. That's useful. What, that's it? Is it made of gold at least? Can we sell it? Give it to me! Whoa, what? Let's rock! Oh, crap. Oh, uh, yeah, exactly. Well, I'm signing off, but let's hope to meet again soon. Now back to the studio with our sponsor, Easy Dungeon. With e All right, now we got trouble. All right, this time it's for real. The battle is going to be a tough one, as from now on, the difficulty setting you choose is going to be taken into account. You can still access your inventory during the planning phase to equip items or pick consumables. This can be useful to analyze the situation and devise a strategy. Position your characters as you see fit and then click fight when you're ready. All right, so everybody's got to kind of get behind cover. Um... Well, who's behind cover? Okay. Who's this? The Barbarian? He doesn't need to be behind cover. Alright, we're going to move the Barbarian here. Well, the Barbarian doesn't have anything but fighting, but what if he gets shot? Alright, so let's move him here. Oh, wait. Sorry, wrong guy. Alright, we're going to move him there, and I want to move the wizard to cover. She needs to be protected. Um, who is this? The dwarf. Who else? <coughs> he should probably get into cover. There's some long-range action. Alright, and this guy should probably come here. Alright, let's see what happens. Alright, so what is he doing? We're not moving anywhere, we're attacking. Smack him down. Barbarian's got to come up here. What is he at? Uh, he's just going to take a swing. <laughs> Who's next? The dwarf. What does he do? I don't even remember what he does. I guess he's going to have to come up here. I should have been <laughs> closer. Gato! Ooh. That 
pour Vivi Oh, picking on the barbarian. You just got poisoned. As long as you're poisoned, you'll take some damage at the beginning of every turn. Antidotes like the ones you just found and some healing spells can rid you of the poison. You can also raise your magical resistance to resist poison better. We have some broccoli, and I know the broccoli is doing it. So, what is this? We're going to move him up here. And he's going to blast everybody with his belly. I don't know what happened. Alright, she is going to hit them with a whirlwind. That's as far as she can go. I will right, take it. Toga, Swala, Bootwaza! Alright, we're gonna skip her turn. And this guy, can he get behind somebody? To knife him, maybe? Alright, let's try that. Don't expect all my guys to live through this, because <laughs> I'm not sure it's going to happen. Let's hit him. Oh wait, she's got a ricochet one too. Let's hit the ricochet. Alright. <laughs> still Uh-oh. A patrol is about to get involved. When reinforcements are coming, you'll see them appear in the border of the combat area one turn before they arrive. The red zone indicates where they'll come in. Of course, you could occupy this zone, but then they'll just position themselves right next to it. Let's see how you approach this one. Oh, well, everybody's kind of protected there. The ranger, we need to kill some people here, so... All right, we're gonna smack on the defensive. <coughs> we're gonna hit, um, let's smack this guy with some arrows. Yeah. All right. End his turn. And now the barbarian gets to smack some people down. Let's we're slaughter gonna, them! We're gonna smack this guy. <laughs> Alright, does the barbarian get two smacks? No, let's end this turn. And then we're going to. <coughs> the dwarf is gonna put a smack down on this dude. So the dwarf is done. So what do we, do you think that we want to move? Yeah, we probably want to go here, facing that direction. The ogre is going to smack this dude. Oh, we got, we still got some more dudes. Oh, what was that? Cover. <clears throat> the thief has got what? It's too far, it's not gonna work. What is this one? Can we hit this? Yes, we can hit this guy. Alright, so why is our guy laying on the ground here? So we're gonna move him here. And who is this? This is our elf. Let's see what she has. Ow! 
I don't feel so good. Ends her turn. <clears throat> the enemy has a red shoulder plate and a special portrait. It's an elite. Elites tend to be stronger or slightly less dumb than the others. In game, an enemy dangerousness is symbolized by skulls that appear in their description. Elites have a lot of those. Oh, that's so nice. All right, so this guy needs to get hit right away. So we are going to kill this guy. Yes! Oh, that didn't kill him. All right. And then that ends his turn. Ugh. Is anybody hitting him? Oh, can we heal him? Is there a way to eat stuff? Oh, probably not during combat. Um, so we're going to move him to uh, here. And he's going to take a swing at this dude with a wave. Oh, uh, no, that's not, that would be a waste. We're just going to take this one. Take uh. that worm! My turn! <laughs> Uh oh, they're on my elf. Oh, they almost killed her. Who is this? The dwarf. The dwarf needs to get in this battle over here. So I'm gonna come in here. Oh, you missed, bastard. All right, the ogre is up. Now we can get this dude right here. <coughs> Smash him. Alright, now we gotta get her to get him. So we're gonna go right to. Alright, so I think that's all the other guys, right? So. Maybe go here to hide. Oh, that's right. I should have moved the elf, huh? She's about to go down. <coughs> oh, she's unconscious. So, who do we have here? Can we get to here? And then stab that dude. Oh, that's it. My turn. Arrows in on these dudes. <laughs> ah! I will get him back here. If I move to here, right, and face these guys, and then hit him with the wave. Let's hit him with the wave, baby. Well, oh, if wow. you're trying to help <clears throat> our foes, nice one. I didn't know that you could, if there was friendly fire. Let's end this dude. Oh, not good. Let's get him back over here. We need to get the ogre in on this deal. I'm here, just saying. People tend to forget me. Alright, so who's left her? 
Well, we got to get her in a safe place. And then we got to cast a spell. What does she have? Oh, yeah. Well, we don't want it to hit the girl. Oh, I don't know if it'll matter. We're going to find out. Watch out! Oh, if we don't heal her. Oh, that's right. She's got a healing spell. I forgot. Probably should have healed. Ouch! Oh, another brother down. Oh, did she die die? She didn't die die, did she? That would really suck. Oh, can't do any of that. We gotta move first. You have healing, defensive stance, overwatch, melee. Alright, we're gonna hit this dude with an arrow. Oh! Alright, so now the barbarian is gonna smack this dude up. So now the Barbarian's going to come up behind him. Oh, that was our nice. massacre. Oh, yeah, everybody makes it. Good job. That, was that, that was potion awesome. did look weird. Let's see what we got. We got a leather belt. Some other stuff. I think we're getting the hang of this. Ha! We got him good. Easy. Uh, he's gone. And so is his wheel. Pernicious parsley pies. The only thing left of him is that amulet. It has the same symbol as that weird magic seal. Who gives a shit? It's made of gold. It's mine. Wait, magic items can be very dangerous. Who gives a shit? Whoa, uh, I don't feel so good. <laughs> Help me! No! Oh, that lunatic. He's always grabbing the wrong shit. Excuse me. Oh, hey, dwarf! Get back here or you'll make the elf happy! Good riddance! We've got to get that moron back and continue on our quest. Alright, you can now access the character sheet and skill tree menu. Open it to learn more. Alright, let's do it. Oh. Alright, on the left you find the character sheet. Here you can find your natural attributes, values without equipment, and raise them when you gain a level. This is also where you can check your experience meter XP. Confirm. The statistics you can raise are your main attributes. Agility, strength, constitution, intelligence, courage, and charisma. All right. All right. Uh-oh. Secondary attributes. We're going to let them do this. On the right is your skill tree. Each character has one. It is divided between active skills and passive skills. Skills are divided in numbered tiers from one to five. This means you must first choose row one skills to unlock tier two and so on. Yes, I know that looks like a V, but it's five. All right. <clears throat> Looks like it's already been done, so we're good to go. I like it. I like that they're deciding for me. 
Here you will find a description of your skills. This will display the area of effect, cooldown period, stamina cost, and effects of a skill. A skill's damage is often a percentage of the equipped weapon damage, but can sometimes be a flat value. Don't forget to read the skill description as it may also convey some important information or just dumb stuff. <clears throat> leveling up. Now allocate your attribute points, choose your skills, and confirm the leveling process by pressing confirm. Alright. So I think that they already doled out all of the skills. I'll take it. Oh, but is there one skill point? It looks like there is, right? This is way more useful than stuffing chairs. All right, now we got one active skill point. Oh, this is the ranger, huh? All right. I think I'm going to go with the healer. A real leader needs real skills. All right, so we got to do individual. I thought I said it so that they would put their own skills in. All right, good. All right, we are back and let us see what is going on. I just have to answer a quick work text. Alrighty, so now <coughs> the wheel is all gone. Wait, let's get back to the thief. Do we need the thief? Right, let's parole, patrol the room and see if we can find some stuff to loot. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's right. Let's we have some new gear, so let's see if we can get that to go. See who can wear. The gear. Crap, what a mess. Alright, he can wear a leather belt. I've got some nuts for the squirrels. Okay, we need, um, she can't wear any of this stuff. Oh, she can wear this. But she also needs to heal, so I believe we'll heal her. And does she have a belt? Yes, she already has a belt on. Wait, why is she had a still broken heart? What's happening here? Okay, now she's healed. How ironic for a thief elf. to empty his own pockets. Alright, so we gotta heal him up. Don't mix the potions or boom. Who can wear this? Oh, the, this guy. All right, so we gotta get her him in here. All right, nice. All right, so for some reason he gets that. So rough. Nice. And this is if it for sticks, it's my boots. Him. Where did it go? Hmm. 
Nice. Sexy. And, alright. He could use a belt. No, he can't get those, or can he? Alright. Who else gets a bomb? Hmm. How come people put their hands in my pockets? Alright, good deal. Alright, let's get back to some dungeoning here. Now that we got the hard part done. Should have probably left with that 5,000 gold. Hello, noble adventurers. Would you be interested in some magication? Hi, are you a wizard? Oh, goodness me. I, I'd never. I'm a far magician. Pirin. Tobias Pirin. At your service. Far magician? What is that exactly? I create magical medications called magications. I'm specialized in magic pharmacopoeia called far magic. Fine, but what's it for? Does it actually work or is it bullshit? For example, I have amazing preparations for people who quit drinking or to get rid of hangovers. Adventurers tend to like those. This is well, it's cheap. I got this spot for peanuts. I'm currently just settling in. Come back later. I'll show you some interesting magic. Huh. I thought that no one had ever entered this dungeon before. Oh, quite the contrary. It's very popular. Who told you such things? Our sponsor. Some hooded guy we met at Twisted Vale. Yes, yeah, typical hiring procedure for a party of beginners. Uh, say, by any chance, have you seen a dwarf? He's sort of dwarf-like. Why are we looking for him? We're doing fine with no, him. No, I didn't see him. But if he's small, he could be sneaking by right under our noses. We're also looking for the third statuette of Gradual Fulcrum. No, the statuette of Gladradulfa. I thought it was the baguette of Rapadulfra. No, that's not it. It's... Oh, wait, our sponsor wrote it down on a piece of paper. Ah, never heard of it, sorry. But you should ask around at the inn. <laughs> yeah, right. An inn. In a dungeon? Come. An inn. Do they have ale? Some areas are open to the public. Take the stairs. You'll see for yourself. This is all a bit unnerving. Our victorious party travels forth in its quest for the statuette and their vertically challenged companion, who disappeared after taking hold of a mysterious amulet. You got the basics now. You're free to explore the dungeon on your own. You can find these tips and many others in the game's tips and encyclopedia. Where'd this guy run off to? Well, let's see what he's got. Hmm. How much gold do we have? Maybe we should buy some first aid kits. All right, we'll we'll be back. No, we don't want to go that way yet. Nope, there's a lift. And there's the stairs. Let's take the stairs. Well, it takes a long time, though.
Second chapter, a beer, two curses, three companions. After a pretty erratic right, start in the dungeon of Nahulbuk, our adventures end up in a rather strange bar with a thirst for fresh glory and honorable ale. Or is it the other way around? Yep, it's an actual tavern. Open to the public. <laughs> Crazy. This dungeon is so weird. We should ask around. Maybe someone's seen the dwarf. Remind me why we would want to look for him? Because in our party, no one gets left behind. All right, so we're going to... Hi. Uh, hello? Looking for a dwarf? Maybe. Nope. Now which one do I listen to? The scruffy half-pint or the dimwit and flip-flops here? Indeed, we have a dwarf companion. He's gone missing. I've been hired to find a dwarf. Maybe it's the same guy. I'd be surprised we just got here. Never mind that. Who hired you? The dungeon master? As if was the co-op running this dungeon. There's an evil dwarf stealing stuff, mostly gold and ale. They want him dead. A co-op? Well, this just keeps getting weirder. And what's this about an evil dwarf? Ours isn't evil. Let's forget this weirdo and our rants about dwarves. Spin your head, salad brains. I like a breeze. <laughs> now shut up, everybody. You all help me take him down and we'll split the loot. It's tempting, but we're really, you know, busy. Yeah, just admit you're chicken. Forgot your book bravery and your other pair of pants. I remembered everything. We even have a lighter. In any case, this could be interesting. Might be linked to our dwarf. Uh, why do you say our dwarf? He's not mine. I'm not sure we can trust her. This one seems to be a paladin of Judge Judy. Those guys only serve justice. Thus Judge Judy, oh, that's okay, hilarious. Okay, enough yapping, dumbasses. We'll set up an ambush in the basin room. It's in the west wing. Now move it. Hey, I'm the one who says that stuff. I'm the leader and... Shit. Um, what's this about a leader? You'll find some merchants in the tavern of this dungeon, but mostly that's where you can get some rest before jumping back into. Adventuring. Resting heals all your health points and your character's injuries for a price. This price gets steeper with every chapter. We're all healthy, so I don't think we need to. What are all of these? Let's talk to the waitress. Hello, what's your order? Isn't this tavern kind of weird? Nahalbuk's Inn is renowned throughout the land of Fang. Our specialty is beer and bear stew. Calm. A color yum yum gurgles. What's this guy got to say? The drunk. Uh, statuette, um... Buy me a drink and I'll tell you where they're hidden. He wants to know why his mouth smells like an old dustbin. Yeah, uh, uh yeah, um... Uh, drink, um, obviously, uh, yeah, yeah, I wouldn't. Another truck, but we don't want to talk to trucks. Shall we? Why not? There you go. I knew it. There are no accidents. Well, what's in here? Let's do some looting. The barbarians take all. Nice. We're getting some loot. Take? What am I taking? A poster? Now let's investigate this area, since we're supposed to go the other way first. Huh? 
Hi, we're looking for a statuette. What? You intend to steal from this place? No, no, that's not... Uh, we, we'd like a souvenir from the dungeon. Oh, right, a souvenir. That's right, we do have a gift shop now. Ask the shopkeeper about it. Move along now, nothing to see here. Looks like we've stumbled onto some kind of administrative center. Hello, are you here for your accounting balance? No, we are not. If you exert a commercial activity in the dungeon of Nahobuk, it must be noted. What's this about a co-op? I was expecting... There isn't. In lieu of your typical autocratic, unfounded system based on nepotism, we have... Thus, executive decisions are made according to rules ratified by all employees That's on... very a... specific. Oh and all activities are notified to the central administration to undergo... He's a warlock. His mouth is spouting cursed gibberish. I gibber. think we'll let you get back to work. God, driving me crazy. The Secrets of Chicken, book two. Oh, cool. So we're collecting the put books back in the shelves. Oh, very busy. To serve is to be in servitude. What if I cut your feet off to make earrings? Got time for that? No need, my lord. I'm all ears. Good. Uh, can't say it rings a bell. No, I'm not really into stuff. Really? Why is that? No one knows. At any rate, statuettes are... Thoa? Minions Punishment Cooperative Committee. The Crow, other. I should drop his feet off anyway. So we gotta find all the barbarian books. I think we just have one so far. Busy. We? Who's we? Me and my astral double. I'm trying out fresh combat techniques. What strange weapons? So good. Not surprising for an arms room. What kind of techniques? Astral double perfect parries. I can dodge every attack thanks to my ethereal double's perception. So, you're skilled in wizardry then? I'm well above all that. What I'm doing is called innovative sensory disruption. So you wave your arms around and act all high and mighty? Nothing can touch me, even high-level attacks. Try me, and behold! No. <laughs> <laughs> nice work, bud. You got him good. And how? Talking all that smack. Oh, wait. We got multiple activations. Oh, we got a little puzzle here. Did that work? Oh, we gotta check out the bandana. Crap, what a mess. Back to this it guy. states it's my boots. I think he has. Um, where did I see it? Oh, only this guy can get the hammer. Okay. Oh, he needs a specific passive skill. All right. I don't see anything else. So we can get out of there. Uh-oh. More dwarves here than there are pretzel sticks. Wow! Does that mean there are pretzel trees? We'll bait them out. We just need to set some gold or ale on this thing. Uh, 
Okay, that's the direction we came from. Nothing over there. Let's see what's over here. Oh, there's a door. Let's open it. Yep, I guess we can't open that door. The harder. The harder. Another direction. Let's get a look at the map. I feel like we're going in circles. All right, that just takes us back to the tavern. All right. Let's see what's this way. Astral regeneration. That sounds like it might be good for. Crom doesn't need a map. Do I have heard. something to jot down some quick notes? All right. Awesome. Good. Now we wait. Ready up your weapons and spells. The axe that strikes back. Durandil. Do -do 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 -do. Hey, finders keepers. He looks exactly like his evil twin. Hey, you bastards! You abandoned me here! Left me to die like a fly in Yakak Strong! What is he talking about? I don't know. Looks like he's dead. <gasps> Maybe it's the amulet. A trick worthy of a coward. <clears throat> Deception is the better part of valor. Payback time. I'll rip your guts out. Enough talk! Take him out! Do you think it'd be that easy? Ha <laughs> ha! calls me Snow White, they get a smack in the head. All right, so we got to figure out what's happening here. We need to get undercover. So we need to get her in the cover. That's not who I wanted to get in the cover. I want her to get in the cover. Okay, he can stand there. Who else is here? And these guys, anybody else shooting? Yeah, it looks like they have bows. No, they don't have bows. There's only one dude with bows. Everybody else has got shields. So let's get, uh... Let's kind of get her back. Let's move her to here. This way. And who is this? This is the paladin. We want to move him to the front. Actually, we want to get him here. And uh, we're going to go one at a time. We're going to try the strategy of wiping out one at a time. The seven dwarves shall have their revenge! 
Randomia. The demoness has taken an interest in our group's fate. She often elects individuals who are intellectually challenged, particularly unlucky or incredibly reckless as recipients of her blessings. Thanks to her, you now have access to the Rando Randomia influence gauge. The Randomia influence gauge fills up during battles with every unlucky event or failure. Oops, excuse me. The unluckier your characters are, the more the gauge fills up. As it fills up, the gauge will unlock four tiers, which can be used to ask fate for a leg up during the turn of one of your characters. When the gauge is full, you can either use the ability of the last tier once or use the ability of the first tier multiple times. Also, this gauge is not emptied at the end of combat. You can save it for another battle. Be mindful of random, Randomia's influence. It can help you turn the most desperate situations around. Okay, so what do we want to do here? We would like to attack. We're going to hit this guy with a bow. He missed. Oh, because he's ducking. That's why. So we won't waste another shot on that guy. We're going to move him to here. Up. Uh, the Barbarian, we need to get him right into combat. And we're gonna smack him down. <coughs> Who is this? The Paladin? She's coming in too. Giving some heat. Come on, girl. You'll regret coming down here. Oh, that's right. I forget. They can only go to the certain areas all right he's not gonna be able to reach him there I guess we should start moving him towards this guy Elf, she can get an arrow in on this dude, I think. Let me see. Yes. The elf is gonna move to us. Let's try to put her here. So we got three bow and arrow dudes. That's a win. All right, so we really need to get rid of the bow and arrow dudes right away. But we are going to, what is this? Okay, heals at melee range, so we're just gonna hit him. Oh, no. And then where could we run? I guess we could get behind here. That's right, we'll get the we'll take the chance. Yeah. 
Oh, you are in for it now. How many guys we gotta hit? Everybody's getting shots of opportunity here. I'm not liking that shots of opportunity garbage. Now we want this guy to strike. Can we get behind him? And then hit him with the old backstabber. Oh wait. He hurt his own dude. <laughs> oh, physical resistance. Oh, that's it. End his turn. We need, uh, she doesn't have a shot at anybody, so let's. We're gonna get her to here. Facing this way. Get a little magic happening. Who is this? The thief. Alright. Thief is in trouble. So he should probably get out of there. Just walking by. Oh, we could be in trouble. We gotta start concentrating on all uh, on all of these guys. Well, he's definitely gotta heal himself. So does the elf heal? Okay, that guy's dead, that guy's dead. Um, where can the elf go? No. We hit this guy. Oh, it's not going to bode well if he hits him. Oh, we got two down. Ah, oh, girl's out in the middle of nowhere. Alright, so he's got to smack him down for sure. Alright, now we need to get him out. Heading in this direction. I need the paladin to come in here and give this guy a smack and this whole thing. Oh no! Um. Fly away! Oh, we're in trouble. All right, the ogre is gonna have to do. The ogre is really low on health, so we got to get him out of there as far away as we can. Yeah. Um, we need who is we need her to get protected. Oh, she does have healing. Um, who needs some healing? Oh, he needs some healing for sure. We gotta move first. Okay. Where can we go to hide? There's really nowhere to hide. I have to go here. 
and then hit him with the healing. Critical hit, not good. <clears throat> Alright, so who is left? The evil dwarf will come take him out. Maybe we get behind this dude. Can we hit him with the wave? No. I'm just gonna smack him with this. Oh, oh you missed, you big. How are you gonna miss? We need her out. Come on out of there, girl. You're trying to tell me you can't. Oh, because the ogre's in the way. We're going to delay her turn. Ah, oh, that's not a good thing. We need the ogre back in this battle. Gotta heal somebody. <clears throat> oh, but she can't. Smack these two guys. Toga, swala, bozwaza. All right, there's only three guys left. We gotta hopefully stay alive long enough to be okay. Ah. Oh. Gonna get murdered. I knew it. So who we got left here? Uh, we gotta smack this dude in the back. And the elf can go here. Oh, but then I block her in. Oh, this sucks. Oh, it's not looking good for him. She's trapped. We gotta hit that. And a struggle. I keep trapping that paladin behind those crates, and there's nothing I could do about it. The barbarian is almost dead, so he's. Can he heal? Is there something he can do? No, we gotta get out of here. Dude's got 40. We gotta get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh, we are in trouble. This is a no-go. Can she throw something? I smash the boxes. Everybody's out of action. Oh my! Oh, she's a dunner. Oh 
maybe not. She needs to get out of there. Quick! Who can she heal? Who needs to be healed? Let's see. She's good. Wait, I didn't go anywhere. Oh, she needs to be healed. So everybody needs to be healed. Paladin. Alright, Paladin. Bring the heat. Yeah. Fly away. Yeah. Oh, she got knocked down. Damn! Alright, so the wizard is, has got to throw some heat on this dude right here. Thank you. She's going to move up to here. What's the elf doing? Who is that guy over here? So maybe if we... Where can we go and then take a shot at that dude? Right here. Oh, he's out of range. So we just gotta end the turn. Two against one, I like our odds. Oh, it's three against one. Ah, oh, we are definitely gonna smoke this dude out. hiding behind here. We need to move her. Who is it though? No, she needs a heal. Right, she's up. What does she have? What is that? Health potion? Does she need it? It's a three round cooldown on the healer. That's a little insane. Alright. <clears throat> so we gotta get some fire on this dude. Can't reach him. So we gotta move it up to here. Somebody's in the way. I don't know why she did another back turn. Crazy. Why can't she see him? Okay.
careful with the books. Why? Why? Oh, because the bench is in the way? Alright, we're just gonna end the turn. I knew she'd get a shot in the back because she has her back turned. Catch me if you can. Yes. We're gonna go in there and smack the dickens out of you. We want the full I'll hammer of go. justice on that biatch. Alright, so now... We're gonna full out torch this dude. Ah, uh, she got him. Wait, how come she can't get him? He's right here. You can't hit him? Why? Why? I don't get it. Oh, you are so in trouble, dude. It's a wrap. See that, losers? There it is! Woohoo! That was a long one, man. This is kind of like a, a, a mindless chess match here. Heal everybody. Take all the gold. We're gonna wrap this up. That was awesome. Look at that. Well, Let's congrats, see how the story Lawrence. goes. Justice has been dealt. Didn't think you could pull your weight. Thought I'd just be using you as meat shields. Hey, that's mean. We could have been hurt. What the hell is going on? It's like going through a troll's latrine. I've been through the ringer. Ah, we must have lifted the curse by destroying those abominations. <laughs> That'll teach you not to pick up amulets. See? I wasn't bullshitting you. I must say, I misjudged you. Whoa. Oh then maybe you'd like to team up. We're looking for a cursed statuette. Not right now. Gotta collect the bounty. I'll find you as soon as I have the gold. We'll talk about your statuette then. In the meantime, go to the VIP room at the inn. Always full of wizards and money bags. Wizards, huh? Do you think they could give us some intel? Never know if you don't ask, right? Worst case, they don't talk. You All right, let's heal everybody up. Hope she doesn't forget me, us. I think she'll keep her word. Paladins can't go around breaking oaths, especially when they serve justice. What an awful life! How do they ever manage to stay true to their word? Yeah? Care to elaborate on that one? Later, maybe. Pinky swear. Look, the amulet is still on the ground. Let's go to this VIP room. Maybe there'll be poets and musicians. And some decent ale. We can plunder. We'll see about that, but try not to be so dense. Everyone ready? Let's go forth. Up, uh, up. Uh. Thief. Great, now we gotta deal with the evil thief. Alright, let's see who needs to be healed. Why is he the only one that needs to be healed? Well, it tastes bad. Reminds me of my granny's soup. That didn't heal him? Bandages to heal him, huh? Oh, everybody's hurt. Alright, so we're gonna use the first aid kit on um, What's in there? Ah, my bad. Yeah, I figured that would heal him completely. What if he eats? Oh, there's health potions here. We can use these. No? Doesn't do anything? Alright. 
I don't get it. <sighs> All right, let's go back to her. How can people put their hands in my pockets? She's got skills. What's up? All right, we got to go with the healer. Great. How about a hug? All right, passive skills. On this <clears throat> All right. Confirm the changes. All right, we're going to end it here. Let's find our save, which is this one. And that's a wrap. Thanks for watching. See you next time.